watching the first episode of the Tanya Green Show on Digicel Play TV. We are so happy that you've decided to join us. We want to thank all of our fans and friends who have been supporting the show thus far. Now, as you're aware, we in Dominica are preparing for what we dub the Rel Mass Carnival 2015. But before I tell you about plans for this year's carnival, we want to ensure that you understand what carnival really is, how it originated, and how it has evolved. Let's take a look. Dubbed as the Rel Mass, Mass Dominic attracts revelers from far and wide to witness a dazzling display of social solidarity and a cultural explosion of music, art, and dance. The pre-Lenten festivities which first started by the Catholic Europeans in the 1970s have evolved dramatically. What began as a tradition of wild costume festivals and carousing by freed slaves celebrating their freedom through masquerade, dancing and singing in the streets soon became a fundamental aspect of carnival as it was a rare opportunity for revelers to celebrate a culture uniquely their own. Mass Dominic, renowned as the Rel Mass for keeping to the traditional roots, celebrates carnival with street parade costumes such as the Sensei or Bois Bois, drumming from the Lapo Capwit Band and dancing to the Calypso or Buya music in the early hours of Juve morning up until Carnival Tuesday. Recognized as one of Dominica's three signature events, Mass Dominic the Rel Mass remains sought after by many of the regional and international media. Its popularity provides invaluable and far-reaching exposure for Dominica and all its offerings as a cultural and festival haven. I'm pretty sure that this was an eye-opener for those of you who had no idea how Carnival originated. Now, back in December 2014, we saw the official media launch of Carnival right here at the Fortune Hotel. The activities were launched under the theme, C'est la vie nous. In essence, what that really means is, it's our life. Dominica will continue to be a major player in the promotion of Carnival in the Caribbean for what we believe to be the most original and enjoyable carnivals in the world. As you saw from the, the video, alone it's enjoyable, but it's also very safe compared to many other countries. This is Mercury Bank for 2015. Bad company, back in the lies. This is the Mercury Band for 2015. Bad Company, Back in the Lies. Sparkle Queen. It's Mercury's Back in the Lies version of Snow Queen. Passion Ivy, the Back in the Lies version of Poison Ivy. This is Fantasy Dominic and Hysteria. A, ba a brand new band for Carnival Dominic, it's Carnival 2015. C'est la vie nous. This is Fantasy Dominic, you saw Mercury earlier on. Oh my goodness, you will agree that the costume bands look absolutely lovely. And already I'm so excited about what Carnival 2015 will bring. Joining me now to talk more about Carnival 2015 is Product Promotions Manager of the Discover Dominique Authority, Mrs. Kathleen Coffey John Jules. Kathy, thanks for joining me on the Tanya Green Show. Thank you so much for joining me on the first edition of the Tanya Green Show. How are you doing? I'm doing fine. It's a pleasure to be here. Thanks for having us. Okay, great. Now we're getting ready for Carnival. The buzz is around. Everybody is excited. Yes. There are so many activities leading up to the, the, the climax of, of Carnival 2015, which is actually on the 16th and 17th of February 2015. Just a few weeks ago. Just ago. a few yes. weeks yes, away. Yes, yes. No. Tell us, what are some of the big plans? Oh yes, um, we have a packed calendar of events this year, I must say. I'm very excited about it as well. 
we first of all we've moved the carnival the national queen show pageant to the sixth so we even have a longer period in terms of pageantry and we have the week of the the the, the week following the National Queen pageant. We're having a lot of musical explosions, you know, bands, fets, and all of that. And we have added a new component this year. We have a Buyo Fest. So this Buyo is very fest. exciting. What, yes. What's that about? Well, Dominica is all about Buyo. All <laughs> bands play Buyo songs, you know, and Buyo music is what we like, Calypso, Buyo combined. So we are having a Buyo Festival where most of the local bands are on, on stage to be able to just come up, you know, to give kind of the persons a, a taste of the carnival. Okay, what wonderful. It is. That, that sounds really exciting. Yes. Now, Kathleen, um, every year we aspire to improve the carnival product of Dominica. Yes, yes. Um, talk to us about some of the recent ac accomplishments. In terms of carnival, well, as I said, one of the key areas that we've looked at this year, you know, with the several discussions, stakeholders' meetings, was to move the Queen Show, the carnival, the national Queen Show pageant to one week before. We had several discussions in that area because we understand that most times in the past, the carnival Queen Show is the night before the Calypso Show, yes. then it's Sunday, then it's carnival, and that's done. So what if you have it one, yes, we have change. a pageant week, you know, where you have all the various pageantry, teenage pageant, modest queen show, the queen show itself, and then that person who gets the carnival queens, you know, who reigns for that year, who's going to reign for that year, would have, in fact, an additional week to be able to go out there and be Dominica's, you know, national queen for another week. So a pageant week as well as a bouillon and other fit for the following week leading up to carnival. Because you do the bouillon, you do the, you have the Stardom Calypso Tent, King of Stardom Calypso Tent the Wednesday. The Thursday you have Mass Camp, King of the Tents. Friday you have a bouillon fair. Saturday you have the Calypso mm -hmm. final. So this week is packed with just activities and we think that the, the queen show itself targets a separate audience and we're trying to make sure that it works well. Great, great, I wish you all the best with that. Now, you know, the success of Carnival in Dominica mm -hmm. is, is, is largely dependent on the support from our sponsors, oh, yes. from our partners. Oh, yes. How oh, yes. forthcoming have we have been? We, this year has been a very good year for us so far because we've had so far seven of the Carnival Queens, six of them have been given sponsorship from our local sponsors, so we are elated. We commend them on that because without them, in order to preserve our culture and arts, our heritage, it's dependent on them. Yes, the government of Dominica and us can do what we have to do, but the local sponsorship is key because we have to preserve our natural heritage and we do not want to see it die out. And they come in on board in order to support Carnival in various forms. We really are very appreciative of that. And as I said, this year, six of the kings out of seven have gotten have secured sponsorship. That's wonderful. So that's, that's wonderful. That's, that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Now you know, I know over the years we've been making tremendous efforts at marketing Dominica's Carnival internationally. Yes, How yes. are we doing? Yes, we are we are we are we are we are way up on this because what we're trying to do is to very make sure that it's differentiated. Dominica's Carnival is an original carnival. It's Mass Dominic. It's not Trinidad, it's not St. Lucia. Yes. It's always. And what we try to portray out there in the international market is that it's different. We have a lot of diasporas coming back home and what has happened lately they always bring friends, they bring persons, and they all say it's so different from what it is that they used to. So we are not the train at Carnival, it's not very commercialized, as you know, but our Sensei, our Black Devils, our Lapu Kabwit, this is what we promote out there, and it goes on well because it's different, it's unique. Kathy, I'll ask you a personal question. <laughs> Are you a reveler? Oh, yes. Can I, I expect to see you in a costume <laughs> on, on Carnival Monday? You may, not recognize, me, you know, you may you, not recognize me, you know, you may not recognize me. I won't recognize you. No. Okay. Well, I love well, Carnival. Are, I are love you going Carnival. to be in any particular band? I, I usually do. I'm always in the yes. I'm trying so a costume band, but Juve is my favorite area. Juve? Oh, yes. Oh, okay. Oh, yes. <laughs> well, since we're talking Juve, I want to take the opportunity to tell our viewers that Digicel Play will be organizing a special band. And at the same time, we're asking you to make sure that you register at the DFC office yes. so we know that you're there. You'll be judged as well. Mm -hmm. And that's a very critical component of the Juve band itself. So Persons are being judged. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Excellent. You know? So what is your favorite aspect of Carnival? Juve. Juve. <laughs> yes, okay, yes. Okay. I love right. everything about Carnival. I love for, the for, Calypso. For I love the... For, for those of us in the audience who have no idea what Juve is all about, can you just tell ah, us? It's, it's the time of the age. It's four o'clock in the morning, it's pitch dark, and you have all these costumes. Persons who are shy of wearing certain costumes during this time of day, you know, at four o'clock in the morning, they're not shy anymore, they wear it. And the fun part is when the sun comes out, here you are, you're revealed. <laughs> Definitely that, that, that we should look forward to. We probably should pitch some cameras. Lots of outfits. <laughs> and look out for Kathy in the Juve band. <laughs> <laughs> Product, Carnival is promotions. great. Carnival is great. Carnival is great. The Calypso that precedes, you know, and all of the other events. The Queen Show, the National Queen Show pageant, the Teenage. I mean, Carnival 
it's always, you okay. know, and we have to come, come together as Dominicans to just sustain that. Okay. Stay in our culture. You heard it from the product promotions and manager at the Discover Dominica Authority, Kathleen Coffey John Jules, inviting all and sundry to be part of Dominica's Carnival 2015. C'est la vie nous. C'est la vie nous. <laughs> Find a place if you fall through frustration. Calypso still will give you a chance because the country nice by the country nice. And if you fall down sick, neighbors will come quick, quick, quick. Don't mind if they gossip in their hands, they don't mean it because the country nice boy. The country nice. Imagine visitors and them come from overseas. Voting a government and tomorrow they flee. No need to protest, yes, everybody please. You come to the right place at the right time. Everybody feel fine, start up. Dominica is a parrot. Hey, 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 hey. Don't die, 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 die,